I'm going to eat at McDonald's and get stretched. Welcome to McDonald's. How may I help you? I would like 1 million Big Macs, 10 billion French fries, and 4. Oh, 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 Dr. Peppers. Okay. This is CBS 5 Eyewitness News. Tonight, Richmond police are investigating an alleged gang rape as a possible hate crime. A woman says that her attackers targeted her because she's a lesbian. She tells police that four men approached her Saturday night on Visalia. Here is your meal. You are looking live at what could be the next target for home invaders in Las Vegas, a typical neighborhood where violent thieves could strike at any time. They are home invaders. You'd be surprised at how they are approaching their... Whoa, I'm so, 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 so needy. What a great email. Oh no, I am stressed. My parents will kill me if they see me like this. An update on the Packers tight end's condition after he spends a night in the ICU. Website glitch. People in Northeast Wisconsin frustrated as they wait for the new healthcare website to... My food is actually grounded, grounded, grounded for life. Live from the Coin Center in downtown Portland. This is Coin 6 News. Watching out for you. Well, it may not be enough to end the drought, but every drop helps. It's been nearly two weeks since we've had any measurable rain. And today the road... Anthony, how dare you get stretched? KHOU 11 News starts now. Now it's Hannah, mother and father under investigation after their son is left disfigured by handcuffs they allegedly placed on the three-year-old. Chipotle ordered to pay a Houston family more than $7 million after a 16-year-old worker makes... You are grounded, grounded, grounded for life. Right now, WCDX News begins with your forecast first. Sponsored by Alabama Foundation Specialists. Good Tuesday evening. I'm Chief Meteorologist Maggie Denizio. Isolated showers and storms did move across the Tennessee Valley this afternoon, but with the loss of sunshine, the showers and storms have sent... You are grounded forever. Now, with the latest breaking news, live reports from around Kern County, and your latest weather with Storm Shield Doppler. From the KERO studios in downtown Bakersfield, this is 23 ABC News. And we begin tonight with our extreme heat temperatures well over the century mark, forcing the Kern High School District to cancel games and practice. You are grounded forever. Go to bed now. Family members of Jose Gardu Garduno say they found out about the deadly crash from his co-workers who were driving past the accident on their way to work. 28-year-old Jose Bibriesca Garduno was killed in a crash on Highway 46 earlier this morning. He was on his way to work at Wonderful Pistachios.